Today, we are going to discuss the definition of type X gypsum panels. We will also clear up some misconceptions that cause confusion in the field. Definitions for type X gypsum panels will be included within the International Building Code, the International Residential Code, and the International Fire Code with the publication of the 2024 versions. The definition as it will appear in the International Building Code reads, quote, type X, a gypsum panel product with special core additives to increase the fire resistance as specified by the applicable standards listed in Table 2506.2. Table 2506.2 includes many different standards for various kinds of gypsum panel products. However, most of those standards define type X in much more detail. For example, the GA600 Fire Resistance Design Control Design Manual notes that type X gypsum board is defined in ASTM C 1396 standard specification for gypsum board as a gypsum board that provides not less than one hour fire resistance for boards five eighths inch thick and not less than three fourths of an hour fire resistance for boards one half inch thick. When tested in accordance with specified requirements to ASTM E 119 standard test methods for fire tests of building construction and materials. The specified requirements as described in C1396 and other standards for the ASTM E119 test method are precisely how the assembly should be constructed for testing and verifying a board as type X, including type, size, spacing of fasteners, and all the framing and application details. In short, type X must meet a performance-based set of criteria when tested in a specific way. Now on to misconceptions. Remember, the fire resistance rating for type X one hour for five eighths inch and three fourths of an hour for one half inch applies to the system as tested using the specific instruction method and not to individual chips and panels. However, again, it does allow the panels to be considered type X. Masonry units and additional composite assemblies of structural materials for buildings are tested using E119, but it is the assemblies, not the products, that derive a rating from the test. It is also worth noting that another test, namely the flame spread test, ASTM E84, standard test method for surface burning characteristics of building materials, is not used exclusively for gypsum panels, nor is it an indicator that a panel is type X. This test is performed on numerous building materials, including other panel products, conduit, plumbing, and wood products, to name just a few. I'm Michael Schmeider, Director of Code Standards and Research for the Gypsum Association, and thank you for tuning in.